hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by to watch this video my name is rita amanir i do travel and lifestyle vlogs so if you're new here consider subscribing to my channel down below and make sure you tap the notification bell so that every time i upload a video you will be notified so in today's video still i'm continuing with my youtube no not youtube swimming journey if you've watched my video that i uploaded before that is if you're not new here i uploaded the first video where i shared swimming tips and i shared my me to learn how to swim so today is my fourth lesson i should say yeah this is my fourth lesson my th that was my third lesson so i'm heading there and today i'm sharing something different i'm just going to be showing you what i pack when i'm going for swimming and i'll show you that and then we shall spend the day together maybe later in the evening see how the day goes will i go for band will i stay at home we'll see that as the day goes on so enjoy the video and don't forget to subscribe so basically this is what i pack mm -hmm. ignore the bag and ignore the diary ignore the jewelry because i really wear jewelry so i pack a mirror this is like a mirror my friend broke not my friend my cousin bought me this it's hard to open but it's like a mac powder and the powder got done so i now use it as a mirror i pack usually a deodorant but i have two so i use beauty finish and go fresh now i recommend that you use beauty finish because it's dry this one is not dry so i usually don't use that one i pack my nivea lotion because the lotion is better on the hands and the vaseline is better on the face i use that ballet if you follow me on instagram you know that i've posted these two before and how i use them i use this 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 is this can be found at any supermarket in Kampala really it's a body fragrance mist then that's my swim cap I bought that in downtown Kampala at 10,000 shillings that's about five dollars or even less I carry this lipstick to put on after I have my shades this is my pack for this my bag this is where i put my money and my phone some tissues i carry the scarf because i like to use the scarf to blow my nose i don't like blowing my nose from the water i just feel like it's so unclean so i put this on the side of the pool and i use it to blow my nose when like water enters my nose then i pack my dress this dress is from the fashion spot ug so i pack that to wear after i've gone to the pool so i recommend that you pack a dress because when you pack a uh, when you pack uh what do they call it when you pack uh like trousers especially after you finished swimming usually you the whole body is wet so it's hard and there is a sudden hardness from the chlorine in the water so it becomes hard for you to pull up the pants so a dress is much better because you can just throw it in as you dry ignore my diary this is my bag i don't have uh what do they call this I don't have like a tote bag so i use this to pack and that's basically what i go with I
Let's go. I wake up to a little bit of drool on my pillow, feel like it's gonna be a bad day. Yeah, I'm tired of shit, and the coffee ain't hit yet. Yeah, damn, ain't that great. I don't wanna go to work, cause my boss is a jerk, and I'm not even that paid. I need a change in my life, cause I don't feel alive, and there's nothing that makes me happy. Oh. Hold my beer for a minute I'm about to quit my job Cash in for a ticket I'm going on a trip And I don't plan to visit I'm gonna stay there Till I feel like I'm winning Oh And this is just the beginning I need a big change Help me feel like living I need a big swing Home runs I'm hitting And I'll never look back Moving on till I get it all And we all got dreams We all want things But what you gonna do for it? How you gonna move for it? What you gonna be? And do you believe To pick the tickets but imagine the tickets are not there apparently the promoter doesn't have tickets i find that so unserious because it's monday and the guy is not even there so i'm having second thoughts about a concert i'm like is this concert going to be organized if at all the promoter doesn't have tickets available so i'm thinking twice but anyway i left behind my number and they said they are going to call me and then I can send a guy, a border guy to pick the tickets because I want two tickets for me and my friend Mel because she's the one I'm going with. So I hope we get the tickets. I'll keep you guys posted if I get the tickets or not. And there are only two places where you can get the tickets. So I feel like it's limiting as well because the other places like Bakuli, that's too far. Already this nail villa is too far. I put in transport all the way to come today for those tickets. So I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope I get them. Because I really want to go for Chameleon's concert. Like, in this lifetime, there is no way I can miss his concert. So, I hope I get the tickets. Mm -hmm. Let's go. I wake up to a little bit of drool on my pillow. Feel like it's gonna be a bad day. Yeah, I'm tired of shit, and the coffee ain't hit yet. Yeah, damn, ain't that great. Nice. I don't wanna go to work, cause my. Hi, guys, so I'm here at the mall. I'm finally going to buy the tickets. They called me and they told me that the tickets are now available. So I'm finally getting them. I'm going to Nail Villa, that's where the tickets are being sold. Then I'm going to buy them. After that, I'm going to do my hair. I have a hair appointment because my hair is looking really bad. So I need to go do my hair. Mm -hmm. Let's go. I wake up to a little bit of drool on my pillow, feel like it's gonna be a bad day. Yeah, I'm tired of shit, and the coffee ain't hit yet. Yeah, damn, ain't that great. I don't wanna go to work, cause my boss is a jerk, and I'm not even that paid. I need a change in my life, cause I don't feel alive, and there's nothing that makes me happy. Oh. Hold my beer for a minute I'm about to quit my job Cash in for a ticket I'm going on a trip And I don't plan to visit I'm gonna stay there Till I feel like I'm winning all And this is just the beginning I need a big change Help me feel like living I need a big swing Home runs I'm hitting And I'll never look back Moving on till I get it all And we all got dreams We all want things But what you gonna do for it? How you gonna move for it? What you gonna be? And do you believe Yeah, 
love it, no, I'm doing things right Sipping in the summer on a goose and Sprite Or we'll find a nightclub for the end of the night, oh And we all got dreams We all want things But what you gonna do? Hi guys, how are you doing? So, now update, update The reason why I haven't been like filming Why I didn't film a detailed video at the salon Is because I got issues with my power bank. My power bank got spoiled, and of course, it, I couldn't film. So, like at the saloon, I couldn't give those guys my phone to charge because I don't trust saloon sockets. They can either blow up your phone or your charger. Usually, their power has issues. So that's why I showed like a short snippet of me at the saloon. But the hair was done by them. If you can see the hair it really 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 looks good these are called butterfly locks so i would leave the, the the number to my lady who did this hair in the description box and in the first comment you can contact her the, if you live in uganda the saloon is at Bugolobi market once you call that number she will come and pick you the shop number is 52d but you have to call them like the day before, sort of like book so that they know that you're coming because sometimes they have like people so you may get there and then your hair is done like late. So you'd rather call them and book like the day before or two days before you go there. But I highly really recommend them. They have a small salon but they are very professional. They take care of you. They wash your hair properly. They plate you well. If you can see the hair really. It really looks good, it's even longer and it's very, really, really, really light on the head. So I love this one. So support my ladies. Otherwise, I think I'm going to end the video here. And I'll see you guys in another video. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram because like I told you, I post personable content there on my stories. So I recommend that you follow me on Instagram and subscribe to my YouTube channel as well for longer, interesting, nice. Videos. So I'll see you in another video. Bye!